NCSA is the National Center for Supercomputing Applications. What we do is bring in new computational platforms, new operating systems, new tools, and work with the researchers in science and industry in the U.S. to learn how to use these systems, how to solve unique problems that need solutions now. The researchers who use NCSA are tackling some of the most important problems facing our world and society. These include things like how a cell actually operates from basic principles. What is the path of a tornado through the community? How can a community respond to such a disaster? What is actually happening in the universe? How do we model this through cosmology and astrophysics? We also have a number of industrial partners, generally companies from the Fortune 500. The common thread among those large industries for the use of HPC was modeling and simulation. They wanted to build things, they wanted to find things. What we're learning today is that industry says these machines are too hard to use. They are too difficult to program. We can't get access. We need to reach down to other layers of industry to be able to utilize HPC in brand new ways. The top 500 benchmark is used to evaluate the performance of large-scale systems as a comparative measure uh, across high-performance computing systems across the world. For our top 500 runs, we use our Abe computer here at NCSA. We installed Windows HPC Server 2008 on 1,200 compute nodes, utilizing 9,600 processing cores. We put it on the systems we've got now, and we were quite gratified at the results. We were very excited about the outcome of this project. We were able to achieve 68.5 teraflops of performance, which translates to about 77.7% .7 efficiency. With Windows HPC Server 2008, we were able to go from bare metal to 1,200 compute nodes running the top 500 tests in four hours. Our goal is ultimate flexibility for the user. We have the ability within the Abe system to take compute nodes and reboot them from Linux to Windows or back based on workloads submitted by the users. So now our Abe system has become a dual boot cluster in many respects. It was important for us to work within an interoperable environment using common software stacks across our compute nodes, which could be in either a Linux or Windows mode. The significance of the top 500 run using a Windows operating system is that it opens the possibilities for other industries to utilize HPC that may not have been thinking of it. That may include medical, it may include uh, Wall Street, insurance, uh, large data users uh, that were not involved in modeling and simulation. So as companies want to migrate from what may be on a desktop to what may be in the HPC environment, Windows becomes very important. How do we move those engineers beyond that desktop and really take advantage of, of clusters or 300 processors or 3,000 processors instead of 32? That migration, we expect to be easier if Windows is on both the workstation and the cluster. The tools in Windows HPC Server 2008 are common and have a look and feel that's integrated in a way that seems familiar to the common user. As we look ahead to using Microsoft with our industrial partners, we know that we can provide them a platform that will scale, that is reliable, that will be useful to them. We have five machines on the floor today at NCSA. Up until very recently, each of those five machines had a different software stack to, to use to actually run your application on those machines. Five different ways, if you had software work on one, it, you could not take that automatically and run it on another machine. That is a barrier to growth, it's a barrier to productivity today. We need to break that barrier in order to make industry more productive. The Windows platform is the perfect target for providing long-term stability and consistency of interfaces and environments for ISVs. NCSA loves to see the possibilities. We are a place where industry can come to experiment, to test things, to consider the possibilities and how far they can push software and how far they can push their applications. Windows HPC server software opens a, an entirely new avenue for tiers of industry that have not utilized HPC until now.